guys welcome back to another episode of no man's sky so last episode we explored a couple planets i want to explore um maybe one or two more depending on how much time we have today uh there's we also got this um curiosity thing so i wanted to put that down in our base as well so i just need to grab that from here uh, it's actually quite big so we need to find a spot for it um, let's put it over here, I guess. Or maybe... I have no idea, actually, where to put it. Might be able to fit it right in here. Might not obstruct anything. Kind of blocks... Uh, yeah, maybe not, because it kind of blocks the plant, right? We're going to be putting storage there, so let's see if we have room up here somewhere for it. Could put it over here. Yeah. Yeah, I think that looks good. Okay. Um, we have some farming to do first, uh, like always. So grab that. We should have enough to make one circuit board now. So grab these. Got the star bulbs. And then we have the remainder of the stuff that we need upstairs. Got some of these things too that we can sell for profit. So that, and I think we require this as well, I'm not sure. Grab these, and those. And we have the um, technician that we need to go to, or the mechanic, or whatever his name is. So let's quickly put a circuit board together. We need that, and we need that and then we can finally create up that which is worth nine hundred and sixteen thousand two hundred and fifty units which isn't too bad actually okay so let's go ahead and put some of this um way and then we'll do the uh, technician missions don't need that on us put that in there uh, we'll sell these but uh, let's go ahead and talk to him first. All right. Um, I think we already have that built. Except. Yeah, we already have that built though. So we could probably just go directly back to him. Thank you. 
Great. So I got to a transmission tower in time. I ended up taking my spaceship in order to go there. And I'm just... I got technology for a mining laser, which we haven't had unlocked yet. Uh, I also installed a couple modules that he gave us for our um, rover. So we'll be able to um, get a little bit of a boost from boost power and top speed is increased by 27%. So um, the boost power is increased by 13%. So that's not too bad. And I just need 100 chromatic metal or chromatic yeah i think it is spelled chromatic is it chromatic yeah so chromatic metal and magnetized ferrite which we should have yeah we do so we need 25 of this and i think it was 100 i think it was yeah it sounded like it was 100 okay so we can craft this up quickly and we could return to the the guy. I'm going to hold off on that just for the moment because I did want to explore um, those planets today as well. So we're gonna go to go to that system that we were in last episode. So the system, and we're going to go explore at least one one planet. If we have enough time for one more, then I think there's like two that are unexplored. So I'm not sure what they're like at the moment, so we'll, we might skip one or two depending if it's the hostility of the planet and environment. We don't have much for the way of um, environmental safety. We have some cold protection and I think radiation protection, but uh, no hot, prote hot protection and cold protection. Oh, we have underwater breathing, but we don't have anything really for other extreme planets so um yeah we'll do that i think that'll be good and then maybe next episode we can do a little bit more of those missions just so it's a little bit more balanced you know so because i can't imagine doing all the base missions are all that exciting and stuff right so all right let's see here uh, there's two planets over there we might have discovered those already um Oh, this was discovered by somebody else, though. I don't think we've discovered it. Okay. And there was this planet, and I think there's a planet somewhere... Whoa, that scared me. Uh, somewhere around here. That's the one that we were to yesterday, so there should be... Alright, so I did find one of the planets. Uh, this one uh, we got to is an extreme planet. So thankfully it's cold, uh, a very cold planet, which we were able to, um, you know, get some frost crystals. That will help later on for um, some stuff. Though um, 
if we had a rover that would actually be more ideal because we have the protection on it and we would be able to pop in and out but we don't actually have a freighter yet so unfortunately we can't just do that however uh i did read that um what do you call it the um facility Yes, I get that. <laughs> he was telling me extreme temperature detected. Um, yeah, so I raided that facility and we were able to get um, some stuff from it. Uh, we got one unlock for that facility, so that's good. Though it's just too cold on this planet to really do any exploring or anything like that. So, And I don't have any additional... Oh, I do have additional um, on batteries, but we're going to need those for... Um, the rover missions and the other world that is in the system is um an extreme sentinel planet so we can't really explore that one too much either i mean we could go down to take a look but that's about it but anyhow my game was a little bit bugged out too it was um for some reason not getting what the wanted levels away or even sending uh fighter Things I had to relog, so but while I relogged, I was able to um, because I got the the facility thing wrong, right? So the, like the questions, so I ended up just relogging, and when I had that, I had the opportunity to actually go in and um, actually redo that question, and I got it right the second time, so that worked out. All right, so I think what we'll do is we'll go back to the space station. And... I think that's all the planets that we really have in this particular system. Uh, if we want to explore that hostile one, that would be an option, but... It's just... I don't know, I don't really feel like dying. <laughs> oh, and we lost our... Um, Nip, nip bulbs from one of those cargo scans already so unfortunately we didn't get to I forgot what I had it in my inventory just a few different changes that I've done uh, the first few changes is I went ahead and I added some more plants to the 
uh, terminal or the uh, planters a little bit more. So they kind of look like that and uh, I still have this planter to do, but they're a little bit more fuller than they were. Uh, though the coloring seems to be off on s most of them. I, I wanted them to be more um, more of this color, so well, I'll probably have to replace them. It's probably a visual glitch or something, so I'll have to fix that, but that's okay. That's It won't take too much time to do. Uh, one of the other things that I just wanted to quickly do is grab... Well, I want to dismiss uh, that one entity that one pet that we have the this one uh we're gonna just abandon that and we made more progress on the um the one that we do have so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna get it to uh lay an egg but i think it requires food for that so might have enough if not i'm gonna need carbon so I'm going to grab a little bit of this and then I'll do that off camera and I'll just get it to lay its egg before tomorrow or next episode. And that way we'll have, um, we'll be able to modify it a little bit more and prep for um, lowering the uh, playfulness and increasing the actual um, other thing. So. Outside of that, though, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.